This is an ABC 10 News update. Good evening, I'm Derek Stahl in the ABC 10 News studio. The first big rainstorm of the spring brought much needed rain, but it also caused some problems along the coast. We spotted two boats that ran aground. The storm broke them free of their anchors while docked in Coronado. Our crew spotted some Navy and Harbor Patrol police trying to help. No word yet if anyone was on either boat when they ran aground. Grocery store and uh, grocery store workers, I should say, will start resuming negotiations this week to try to avoid a strike. The union has been negotiating a new contract with several major chains in Southern California, including Albertsons, Ralph's and Vons. They've got about 47,000 employees in our region. The union says the stores are only offering modest raises despite massive profits. The grocery stores say they're working to reach a fair deal with the union. Talks will restart on Wednesday. Several local government and business leaders are in Washington, D.C. San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria is among a group spending the week lobbying federal officials for help with local infrastructure projects. That includes the new border crossing under construction and plans for a central transit hub near the airport. The group hopes to get 19 projects funded by the federal infrastructure bill passed last year. ABC 10 News meteorologist Angelica Campos is here with perhaps the biggest story of the day, the rain in our region. <laughs> That's right. But the good news is that it's mostly overnight, and then as we head into your early morning commute, conditions will be improving. There could still be some pockets of showers early morning between 5 a.m. and possibly 7. After that, it'll start to dry out. Temperatures will be hovering in the mid-60s. Still pretty chilly in the mountains in the mid-40s, but expect to see those numbers improving for the middle of the week. I'll give you a closer look at the forecast coming up. 